Okay, hi, hello, or welcome to my channel if you're new here. My name is Savannah Tori, and we are getting back into the vlogs. Um, well, I only did like two vlogs last time, but I really want to get back into the vlogs because this is my final year i'm turning around and i'm ruining my lighting this is my final year um studying biomedical science and i am hoping to go on to med school after this and i want to film my entire year so i remember everything so this is going to be a week in my life i was going to film like a get ready with me but i completely forgot um but i'll show you like the fit i want to show you guys my fit because i really like it today um, and I'm waiting on my taxi. It's going to take about 10 minutes to get here, but it is pouring it down outside today and I don't want to walk. Um, but yeah, I'm going to show you guys my outfit and then we are going to get ready to go and I'm hopefully going to film in school today. I definitely want to do that and I'll take you guys along with everything I do this week for my first week, my first last week back at school. I pardon the mirror, but I have this like cropped shirt from Bershka. I have this white tank top from Bershka also. I have these jeans. They're like wide leg jeans from Kenzie's. And then I'm wearing my green campuses. Sorry about the mess underneath my bed. And then obviously I'm going to turn around and I have my backpack today because computer does not fit in any of my other bags so i have to go back to my reins bag not that i'm hating on it i love my reins bag but yeah we're gonna go fill up my water bottle and then we're gonna head downstairs okay guys after like 100 years of waffling i'm finally downstairs um and i have ugh, remembered my snacks for my friend i've got my water bottle in my bag and we're about to head out to the taxi um i'm actually really excited for my first day back to school but it's clear that the London weather is not very, because I'm going to show you guys the weather. It's not, it's not pretty at all. It is not looking back to school vibes at all. To uh, yeah, I'm going into uni today. Uni? Yeah, first right. day back. Uni, yeah. I'm at Kingston. Oh, Kingston, right? <laughs> yeah, Kingston. Oh. What are you studying? I'm studying biomedical science. Wow. <laughs> which year are you at? I'm in my final year now. Final year? Okay guys, I had to get out of the taxi and walk because the tunnel that we usually drive through, it is so flooded and oh my word, I have to walk through that. Oh my word, I can't walk through that. <laughs> That's ridiculous. I think I am going to miss my train because I have to walk all the way around and try and get to the train station another way. Uh... Okay, so I found three really nice girls and I made my way around that mess and I'm now at the train station. So we're okay. Hopefully I still get to my class on time, which is not exactly likely right now because some of the trains are delayed due to the um, rain. Um, when we were walking past the train station when we went around, there was a fire truck pulling out the car that was stuck at the end. So hopefully that is resolved by the end of the day. But yeah, we're at the train station. Now we're going to head to school. Okay, I am on the train. I just hope that it leaves on time. Um, I don't think I'm going to be on time to the first lesson because... First of all, there was that issue with the water. I had to walk all the way around and that took me like, I wanna say 15, 20 minutes. And I had to um, miss one of my trains. Okay, so water 
was saying is that my first train obviously i missed that one because of the flooding and then the second train it seems like all of the trains at london waterloo were um delayed because of flooding um so i'm finally on the train and it doesn't seem that it's going to be missing my stop so hopefully if there's a bus when I get to my destination, I hope I can get to class on time because um, it's a relatively small class, um, but there's going to be, I want to say, maybe about a hundred and twenty students packed in that tiny room. So if I can get a seat for that two hour lecture, it will be amazing. Um, I do have a friend, she is apparently there already, so hopefully if she catches us two seats and I get there on time, I can sit down and I can get started with my first lesson. Um, but yeah, today's journey has been a bit of a... I didn't really like it, especially with the flooding. Um, hopefully it's fixed by the time I get home or else I'll have to find another way home. Um, but yeah, that's it for now, I guess. Walking into this lecture was super intimidating, and I think it maybe because the lecture hall was packed, but I sort of related it back to how the year is going to be super packed. Trying to find one of my friends so I can drop off some snacks that I bought her from the States, but she's nowhere to be found. Okay, so I am at lunch now. I decided to go to Joe and the Juice for lunch um, and then I'll head back to campus. Um, I just finished two of my lessons. Well, one of them was an introduction, the second was a lesson, and the information was for a lab that we have coming up and I'm already overwhelmed, but I'm just excited to have started the year again because I felt like at home I was just sitting down and doing nothing. So I'm happy that we're back in school, back doing something productive with my time. Um, but yeah, I'll catch you guys up when I get back into campus. I'll probably go sit in the library and get some work done because with this lab coming up, I am very confused with the information that they gave me, but I am determined to be on top of everything this year. We're back at campus and I'm basically finished my Americano, but we're about to get started on lunch and we are also about to study because I need to understand my lab before the lab happens or else I'll be very confused and I'll probably fail it, which I do not want to do. We don't want to do at all. After lunch, I sat down with two of my friends and we went over the lecture and the lab that we have coming up. Um, and to be honest, getting like a little bit of tutoring from someone that understood it was a little bit okay. Um, but I still needed to go home and do some self-study myself um, to finally like understand what was actually going on. But we made notes for our next lecture, which wasn't really a lecture. It was just an introduction. And I felt like this week was very repetitive in that um, sense. All of the lectures were introductions to the um, topics, our modules that we have, but it was primarily repeated that we need to work on our own and we need to do self-study. And I feel like ever since we've come into uni, that has been like something that we have to do, self-study. So to hear it on repeat throughout the entire week was kind of annoying and it got very boring very quickly. Um, which is not ideal, but I got to distract myself with looking forward to the lectures and the labs that we have coming up. So I tried to distract myself with that and not really pay attention to the introductions, if you understand what I mean by that. Okay, so we finished lunch and now we are heading to our, our, our final two lectures. And then we can go home. Okay, so we are in our... Technically, this is the second lecture because the first two lectures were the same. Um, it was clinical immunology introduction and then we had the very first lecture. This one is, I think, clinical chemistry. And now we're in the introduction lecture and then 
after that we're in the actual lecture but we have to change rooms so we're just here for an hour and hopefully we finish a little bit early so we can get to go home because I am tired from all the information we've taken and I am just I guess overwhelmed right now so I just want to get it over and done with and go home and enjoy my two days of wrapping my head around the stuff and then coming back on uh, Thursday. Okay, we have finished our final class of the day and we are heading home. I am heading home. Kiri is also heading home. Um, I am tired and I'm overwhelmed but when I go home I need to start self-study because the earlier I get on top of that the less work I have to do at the end of the year um, but yeah I will update you guys when I get on the train and make my way home Good morning vlog. Um, today is Thursday. It's been two days since I've updated you guys and the lighting is absolutely ridiculous. Um, it's been two days since I've updated you guys because I have not been going to uni. But I am back into uni and I only have one lecture and a meeting. So today should be relatively light and then I go home. Um, but I will definitely record and then tomorrow I have like a full day again. Um, I left the house in a rush, so I don't know exactly when I'm going to show you my outfit, but I definitely will show you the outfit of the day. Hold on. Okay, um, right now I'm headed to the train station. It is another rainy day, but I will talk to you guys when we get to the train station and maybe show you the fit. Okay, we are at the train station. I wanted to show you guys my outfit from like putting it down, but obviously I'm terrified someone's going to grab it and run away. So, this is a random, you can't even see it, I'll probably see it when I get there. I'll probably do like a fit check before I start my lesson. But I am now at the train station and I'm waiting on my train, I missed one. Um, but the next one should be not a fast one, but it will take me to London, which is okay. Um, and I'll update you guys when we get back into the Hey, good morning vlog and we're back in the messy mirror. Um, I am literally about to run out of the house. My bag is packed, water is in my bag. Um, but I didn't get to show you my outfit for yesterday, so I'm gonna show it to you today. Today's fit is this from this pullover from Pullin Bear, and then I have a top under here. I'm not sure where I got it from. I got these pants from Bershka, and I got um, my Adidas again. Um, so this is the fit, kind of nice. The pants are a bit big, so I put a string. And I don't know if you guys noticed, but the my Caseify case finally came in, so I have that very nice addition. Um, still with my backpack, but yeah, this is the fit. Uh, you can't see the whole thing. I kind of look grungy today, but it's the last day of the week. It is Friday. I'm very excited. I'm just ready to have the weekend here, and hopefully you guys see this video by Sunday. So... Um, yeah, let's go guys. Okay, surprise, surprise, it's another rainy day in London. Um, I am walking in the rain because it was not as bad as it was on Monday. Um, it's still terrible. I'm fighting with my umbrella, so yeah. So for day today's lessons, I have one at 10 to, I think, 12, and then another one from one to two. Nope, that's a lie. <laughs> it's from 11 to 1, and then from 2 to 4, I remember. Okay, so both of them 
are one of them is a new one so it's an introduction to that lecture i can't remember exactly the name oh wait it's the dissertation project and um the second one is an employability class because obviously a lot of us a lot of the students are going into um careers after this but i actually want to sit down and talk to you guys about how i completely messed up for um, the MCAT practice. I'm quite upset about it, but I'm gonna sit down and talk to you guys properly um, when I get home later on today. I completely forgot to talk to you guys when I got home, but the process of taking the MCAT was not explained to me correctly. So instead of studying this year for the entrance next year, I thought I had to study next year for the entrance next year, but this is just a tiny hump in my very long road. And I'm not gonna let that like ruin any of my prospects. So I'm gonna continue on to a post-grad this year and then try again next year for the MCAT. Um, but yeah, if you've watched this far, you've watched the end to the end of the video, and I hope to see you guys next week. Bye! I'm losing my grip, I admit it. I'm lucky if I make it through the night. Cause I don't mind if you call me crazy, long as you call me baby. Yeah, I know, I get a little crazy. Guess that's just what you make me, it's not like me. No.